My friends, as you recall, before ascending into heaven, Jesus told his apostles not to leave Jerusalem. In a previous daily reflection, I referred to this as Jesus' stay-at-home order. And indeed, the apostles, the Virgin Mary, and other disciples did indeed gather in what we believe was the upper room, the cenacle, where Jesus had celebrated the first Eucharist on the night before he died. There in the upper room, they watched and waited and prayed for the coming of the Holy Spirit, just as the risen and exalted Lord had instructed them to do. During this week, you and I have the opportunity to look in on that upper room and to unite ourselves spiritually to those first disciples of the Lord as they prayed for the outpouring of the Holy Spirit. Now, just as many of us are still under stay-at-home orders, we can nonetheless transform our homes into little churches, into upper rooms, where we can gather as families, indeed as a family of disciples, to pray for greater openness to the Holy Spirit, the Spirit we have received in the Church's sacramental life. It is the Spirit who links us to Jesus, the Spirit who enables us to live as the Lord's followers and as active, loving members of the church. Come, Holy Spirit, fill the hearts of the faithful. God bless you. God keep you.